Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 10th, but you know, the timing is fluid, so we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for around the 10th? Good news is arriving. Good news is arriving. You just see the Eight of Wands. So that is good news. Now we get the Devil here. Interesting. Queen of Wands reversed and then the Moon. So there's something below the surface. Somebody's probably not going to be happy. You get the Queen of Wands in reverse. This is somebody that is very controlling. Okay. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Forceful. Uh, entitled. Um... I don't know, maybe self-righteous, but something is not as it seems with a moon card. There's some sort of illusion. Somebody may not be seeing something clearly. Yeah, we may have somebody here that isn't seeing something clearly. Hmm, there's ego here with the devil card. This is a card of ego. There's something below the surface that is about to pop up. These are both ruled by the shadow. So we may have an individual here that is definitely not in the right head space. Okay. This is darkness. Somebody is in a dark space. Okay. Um, they're not seeing something clearly. They may be in their ego. They may be obsessed with control. Somebody is obsessed with control. We talk about this a lot. But there's something that is about to show up, okay? This is like a, you know, this, this is like a puppet master. Somebody is dangling somebody like a puppet, you know? Very, very um, malicious energy. It is malicious. We also may have somebody here that is naive. They're naive. They don't they don't see that, that that something is coming by the looks of things. Definitely something all is not as it seems. And we had this part feels like we have an individual that is um may be confused. They may be confused, or they may be in their ego. They may be. They may be um, jealous. There could be some jealousy issues here. This is somebody who is weak, lacks experience. <laughs> Ace of Pentacles. Somebody is getting an opportunity, a good opportunity. A really, really, really good opportunity. I feel like we have an individual that was controlling. Very controlling, very much wanting to be in control. Enjoyed the control that they had over another person and, and abused their power. It feels like they abused their power. Greed. There's greed here and selfishness. There is with the devil card. But this, this is... There is an opportunity that is coming. Somebody may have some doubts that an opportunity is coming. They may be lacking confidence or something like that. But an opportunity is definitely coming. And it is a big one. Somebody, it's like getting what they asked for. You know what I was going to say before I started this reading? Is somebody's hard work is about to pay off. Yeah. So I feel I feel like that's that's what we got going on here, um, but the devil. I feel like we have somebody here that is has some sort of addictions right next to the moon card. So I we may have an individual that is addicted to power, addicted to control. That's a true addiction. Okay, and this person feels, you know, unworthy or they're feeling lack in their life. They demand control. In a negative manner. So I do feel like we've having we've been having or we have somebody here that 
has abused their power. That's the way I feel. And it feels like they've been uh, controlling. <laughs> I know that I keep saying that. They've been controlling somebody in the wrong way, you know? I feel like we have an individual that's about to get a major upset. You know, they're going to get a major upset or they've had a major upset. They've been in confusion. <laughs> yeah, they have. They've had, because if you think about the shadow, you can't see things clearly. Somebody hasn't been seeing something clearly. They've been naive. King of Wands. I think we're dealing with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We could be dealing with a Pisces or a Capricorn as well, but uh, somebody is about to get what they asked for in some way because that is manifestation. Uh, now the King of Wands is somebody, it's a person that is given to take action comes up with a plan because this is a plan. Somebody is coming up with a plan. King of Wands is very strong, very determined. So we have somebody here that is determined to succeed. Very, very honorable individual with the King of Wands here. I think they are up against somebody that is dishonorable, though. Okay, we have somebody here that is dishonorable. But we have one person here that is uh, noble. Okay, this person is noble and wants to make something work. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Now this is dissatisfied, unrealistic, not practical. Somebody's not happy. Somebody is not happy with a decision that has been made. They're not happy. They're dealing with an individual that is very controlling. But I feel like I feel like there's they are going to do something. Maybe they're going to reveal something they're, because of the devil and the moon card. Somebody may reveal something because they're not happy with a circumstance. King of Wands takes action. Very, very determined. We have a, we have a very strong, determined, proud individual here who has a lot of courage. This person is going to I don't know, something to do with an opportunity. Wants to give somebody an opportunity. Wants to give somebody an opportunity, but whoever they're dealing with it isn't logical. Ooh, interesting, isn't logical? Unbelievable. So it's amazing how the cards come out. Uh, yeah. So we have a nasty, jealous individual here. I think it's the same energy who uh, is, it's almost like this person is trying to stop somebody from getting something, getting an opportunity. Queen of Swords in reverse is somebody that is miserable. So we have a miserable individual here. And, it's, and it doesn't matter what sign it is. This is an energy of misery. Okay? This is a miserable individual. That is hiding something. They're hiding something. Uh, somebody is hiding something. They're hiding an opportunity. They're hiding something. And they're hiding something because maybe they're jealous. Makes sense. I see it all the time. Hey. 
Hierophant, there's a higher power involved here. Believe, have faith. Uh, there's a direct connection to God. We have somebody here that has a direct connection to God. Um, now we got we got the Hierophant versus the devil, which is interesting. We have greed. We have greed. We have uh, ego versus basically kindness and generosity, right? There's guidance. Somebody's going to be receiving some guidance. They're going to be receiving some advice, or there is somebody that can help them. They can, or it could even be a higher power, another energy, you know, from another realm that is guiding somebody, protecting somebody. There's some sort of protection here. There's a higher power involved. It's almost like this higher power is. Guiding somebody in the right direction away from a toxic situation. This is toxic. It's unhealthy. There's unseen problems here. Everything happens for a reason. There's some sort of protection. Somebody may be being protected from something that is uh, not healthy to get involved with. You know what I mean? It's not healthy. It's an illusion. There's more to it than meets the eye. There's some sort of um, instant gratification that comes with connecting to this. But it's not healthy. It's not, it's not something you should invest in. You shouldn't invest in this. Uh, on in binding yourself to this situation, there's lies, there's deception. Some, you know, don't do not invest in this toxic situation. It's like the higher powers. This is guidance. Okay, somebody is is going to be receiving guidance. Maybe it's from above. Maybe it's from their gut. Okay, because this is a card of gut, or from somebody that is very spiritual that has a direct connection to God. Somebody is going to be receiving some sort of guidance to not invest in something that is toxic. It's an illusion. It's uh, There's something that you're not seeing. There's something that's not being seen. There's a reason. There's a reason. There's protection here. You think about the King of Wands, that's a protector as well. So I feel like there's some sort of protection here. Somebody is being protected from an individual that doesn't have good intentions. This person is miserable. So we definitely have a miserable individual here. Um, but that Ace of Pentacles is a new opportunity that you don't see that is coming. There is a new opportunity that is coming. I think we have a rivalry here. We have, we have somebody that is very jealous of another person. That's exactly what we have. This per and this person is trying to stop. I feel like this person is trying to cause trouble. You know, this person is trying to control. They're trying to control an outcome, you know. But a higher power is saying, oh no, that's not going to happen. That's not going to happen. Interesting. Anyhow. Very dissatisfied with these two cards. Somebody is, is very dissatisfied with an outcome. They are not happy at all. This is somebody that um, is in a position, you know, um, I don't know if they're um, in a professional position. This person uh, probably works at a desk, may sit at a desk all day. Doesn't have to be. Whoever this person is, they um very, very intelligent, very smart, very, um, well, like I said, noble. 
um, nine of cups, dissatisfied, but deep, deep fulfillment is coming. Wish fulfillment is coming because we have an individual that is about to give somebody what they deserve. Somebody's about to get a golden opportunity, a big, huge opportunity. Now this is, now the Ace of Pentacles is money or it's an investment or it's, it's prosperity. It's a new business. It's a new job. It's a new home. It's something you can touch. Somebody is about to get an, it could be a loan. It could be it's something of value. Somebody is about to get, and it's upright. So somebody is about to get something of value. Okay, something that will last, something that will be long term. This is something, it could have something to do with a bank because I feel like this is like, I don't know if it's a banker's chair and this is a bank as well. But I feel like there's, there's, there's problems with this because of these two cards, um, the moon and the devil. There's, there's definitely a shadow here. There's darkness. Somebody, somebody has missed something. They've missed something and they've missed something because of their ego. We have ego here and ego here. So, and, uh, we have an individual that needs to reevaluate. They need to reevaluate, but they're refusing to reevaluate because they don't want to admit that they made a mistake. So anyway, but there, there's another person here that is probably seeing it differently because of that. That King of Wands is that, that's a visionary. Okay, that person sees things differently. So somebody is seeing something differently. They're seeing something more more clear, you know, uh, more clearly than the other person was. Um, it, this is like a dead end. It's a dead end. Somebody has gotten themselves involved with a toxic individual that is miserable. There's no, there's no value in, in, con, in continuing to invest in this. There's another opportunity here that you have not seen yet. Okay. Do not invest. This is a message from a higher power. Do not invest in something that wants to make you their puppet. You know, something that is unhealthy, something that is based on lies and deception. If it's not working out, there's a reason you got somebody here that is very selfish, okay, that likes power and control. It's very clear this is somebody who is very controlling and likes the control that they have over other people. And when they get miserable, that's when they exert that power and control. Um, there's jealousy issues. There is. There's jealousy issues here. That's how what I feel. I feel like there's a rivalry. Um... nine of pentacles now this i don't know if there's an inheritance coming or some money coming we have a very hard worker here and it's funny because i said somebody's hard work is about to pay off it's, we may have somebody that is upset. This person is upset. They're not really communicating. They're keeping to themselves. They may be withdrawing a little bit. They're withdrawing because they're up against somebody. It's like a hater. We have a hater here. That's exactly what we have. I see it clearly. So we do. We have a hater here that is abusing their power. But there's another person that sees it differently. They see an opportunity. They see an opportunity for su success. Nine of Pentacles. Now, the Nine of Pentacles is a hard-working individual who has built themselves up. This is like an entrepreneur. We may, we definitely have an entrepreneur here, somebody that may have their own business or has the skills to have their own business. This is definitely somebody that is very skilled. Um, we have an individual that is looking at a self-sufficient individual. And one individual is looking at another individual that has... Uh, really worked hard this person has has uh picked themselves up has done has be has become has become successfully uh you know independently successful okay and now they're getting another opportunity so this is like the ten of pentacles so somebody is going to be getting an opportunity that for prosperity for abundance from another individual this is this is cooking Okay, it's cooking below the surface. 
whoever they're dealing with is probably not going to be happy when they find out. Queen of Wands reverse. This is somebody who's miserable. This person wanted to control to a degree that wasn't reasonable. It wasn't. It wasn't. Anyhow, Nine of Cups reverse. That's dissatisfied. Um, lack of wish fulfillment. Not happy. I mean, not happy over a situation. Somebody's not going to get the outcome that they were looking for. They're not going to get the outcome that they were looking for. And it's because of... another person that is stepping in there's another person that is stepping in it feels like this other this other person is stepping in and seeing somebody's worth seeing somebody's value because the nine of pentacles is a person of worth and value okay somebody is seeing a value that was missed by another person this person whoever missed their that value was very I feel like they were jealous. I feel like they were jealous or spiteful, you know, something like that. There's lies here for sure. There's lies. We have a liar. We have a liar here that's been withholding something, hiding something because they want to control. They want to control. They may have been wanting to hurt another person, you know, to make another person feel bad. It's almost like they gave them instant gratification and ripped it away. Karma never loses an address. Just remember that. So anyway, the King of Wands is somebody who takes action. This person is... Not somebody who sits and waits for something to happen. This is somebody who jumps on it. So somebody is, is going to be uh, taking advantage. They're going to be taking advantage of another person's loss. By the looks of things. And that's the way it goes. That is the way it goes. I think we have an individual who may have felt like... They weren't going to get what they were looking for. They may have been upset. They may they may have felt less than worthy or, you know, but they are going to get an opportunity. With that Ace of Pentacles, that's, a, that's an opportunity. Somebody's been keeping secrets. They've been lying. They have. There's lies here. There's definite lies. There's somebody is going to be making a commitment. They're going to be making a commitment, uh, perhaps with somebody new. They may be severing ties and committing to a new path. Committing to a new investment. Okay. There's definitely some good news arriving because I saw the Eight of Cups, okay? Somebody's wish is about to be granted. I just happened to see that on the bottom. This is prayers being answered. This is a this is a yes answer. This is a fairy godmother granting somebody's wish. It's actually a blessing in disguise that something hasn't worked out. It is because there's a bigger, better offer here. And I know I've been saying this a lot. We have a big, solid opportunity that can last. Oh, it can last for a really, really long time. You add this to this, that is success. Long-term success. Permanence. It could be a permanent home, a permanent, could be a marriage. Somebody could be getting married. 
starting a family business or starting their own business. There could definitely be an inheritance here or somebody is getting a, a money. They're getting money. I feel like there's been some prayers. Somebody has been saying saying their prayers. They've been praying for a solid, stable opportunity that's real. Okay? It's real. It's not going to be ripped away. And they're going to get it. I feel like there's been a tower moment because if you think about the star card that comes after the tower, there's been some something has happened that has been... Uh, caused upheaval, it's caused a major disturbance, it's caused an uproar, it's caused chaos. Something has happened, but now there's this is help arriving to make your dreams come true. So help is arriving and it leads to guaranteed success, but this is a card of faith and this is a card of faith. So you have to have faith. If you don't have faith, and then you're here. Then you're in a deep, dark place. We have somebody here that's in a deep, dark place. It's evident. This person is malicious. They lie. They're jealous. And I feel like uh, they have an opportunity probably to do the right thing. But I don't, I don't think that maybe they will. But I don't think they're going to. I don't think they're going to. So I think somebody else is going to take the opportunity. Unexpected help is arriving. I know it. Deep fulfillment is coming. It is. With the Nine of Cups reversed, it means it may not be here yet. But it's coming. It's coming. Things are about to change. And this is think about it and wish for it. A wish is going to be granted. Somebody's wish is going to be granted after they were dealing with a jealous, malicious, miserable individual who was trying to control them. It's over. Good luck.